You want to play a game on stream, but you don't want your whole room to show. You want a green screen. But how do we remove the green screen in OBS? I'll show you. But first I want to thank our sponsor, Own.Pro. Own.Pro has a free plan and a pro plan. With a free plan, you can get stream labels, copyright free music. You can get five overlays, five free alerts, a chatbot and PayPal donations. And with the pro plan, you get access to so many overlay packs that you can install really, really easily on your OBS. Own.Pro also offers epidemic sound music for your stream. You can get 50% off by using code tree. Link is down below in the description. We're in OBS right now. We edit our camera. And we're gonna right click it and go to filters. What we see here, audio, video, and effect filters. You will have this if your camera also has audio. So if you have a webcam or a camera that has audio in it, you will see these divided, but you don't need the audio for this. So if you click here, we can see that there's all audio things here. We do not need that. We need the ones down here. So effect filters, we want the chroma key here, okay? We immediately see something happening. <laughs> and that is our OBS is going to show because that's what we're recording underneath here. So what we want to do is we want to turn it off first. Now we want to click this on custom and select a color. We can pick a color in here and we're going to pick a little bit of the brighter color and I'm going to put up the saturation a little bit. If we turn it back on, we see it have we all gone right now. <laughs> that's not good. Okay. So we want to play with the similarity. Okay, we can see that we picked the wrong color. You know why? Because now I go away too much. So we can see our, our skin is going away now. That's not good. What we can do is select the color again and try and play with this. It doesn't immediately apply. So if we click on okay, we can see it doesn't immediately apply. We can pick another color and click on here and see if it works better. Some cameras do work better than other cameras with this. We can see this works a lot better it's all black now, which, you know, is the color it's supposed to be. <laughs> but it could be that we a little bit shine through. I think we are a little bit shine through, to be honest. So I've added t that. We're going to make t that real big. It's okay. It's just for, for checking things now. And we can see that we shine through. So it looked like we were good because there was black behind us. But as soon as we have something behind us, we're not actually good. Okay. So we need to go back to filters and we need to start working with this again. So we need to be at least this, but we still have that green screen going on a little bit. So we need to select a color and make sure that we pick a different color. It could be that right now the green screen isn't lit well enough because as you saw, it is super dark here right now. So if you have this, it could be that you need to light your green screen better. So you basically want to keep playing around until you have the green screen nicely set up. And then when you have it set up, why you click alt, and you drag everything in until you just have the part that you are with the green screen. So for example, right now, this is us with the green screen. You can see that the green screen is still there. So we need to work a little bit more on it. I made some adjustments right now and this is a lot better. <laughs> but you really need to play with the green screen. Every time you change your lights, your green screen will look different. So if I would turn my lights on right now in my room, so you'll see that this is going to start being really weird. <laughs> so you could have the skin like this that is super light that could actually green screen away. Everything here is with the green screen. Everything underneath here, that's just what you apply after you green screening out. So now you know how to remove a green screen in your OBS. But there's so much more to learn about OBS. I have a whole playlist full of things you need to learn about OBS. So I'll see you there.